is it difficult to build your own PKI? Well, I think people often overlook the fact that PKI is a mixture of roles, policies, hardware, software, and procedures. And these are all key ingredients. They're all needed to create, manage, distribute, use, store, and revoke digital certificates. And when, and when you take a step back and look at it in reality, a PKI is probably 20, at the max 30% technology, and uh, 70 to 80% policy and procedure. You know, installing technology is a relatively easy exercise, which is why so many organizations that I've dealt with over the years have often ended up with a very difficult certificate, certificate management problem. You know, installing CAs on a project, project basis, going to a variety of providers, sometimes even generating self-signed certificates for individual projects is, is kind of where some organizations have fallen foul of the fact that technology is a very easy thing to install. We can all hit next, next, next without thinking install a particular piece of technology and i'm not suggesting for a moment that every <laughs> every pki out there has been installed in such a haphazard way but the very nature of the way organizations have evolved over the years have meant that you know, there hasn't been a centralized certificate and or crypto function and so the necessity to provide keys and certificates to address a particular project has been required so you know people have gone to the market they've looked at open source tools they've you know, used applications that have been built into the operating system to deliver the all important you know, air quotes certificate function but building a centralized trust infrastructure that's built to best practice built to a standardized policy you know can require some specialist technology you know you would use hardware security module to protect your critical keys that can require some specialist knowledge there's the software that's used to form the PKI, you know, the certification authority, uh, how you offer revocation information, how you enroll users, maybe how you apply digital signatures in the, as an example. You know, these are all can be vendor specific, but vendors do offer comprehensive documentation. There's you know, serious amounts of training that all of these vendors provide. And because PKI is underpinned by standards, like from the likes of International Civil Aviation Organization, NIST, Etsy, the CA Browser Forum, and all of these provide guidance on how the PKI should be designed and built to address a certain set of requirements. People then have to analyze when and if they need public trust or if they need private trust or if they need both, which particular framework are they looking to build their PKI to. But PKI skills in the industry can be hard to find if you're looking to deploy your own to any of the previously mentioned schemes or, or requirements and so you, know, you can look to trust service providers to operate and build your PKI or digital signing service or whatever trust offering you need you know that can and often is the requirement you know, organ smaller organizations medium-sized organizations won't necessarily have the required skills or personnel in-house to be able to roll out a PKI that's built to operational best practice and procedures so they would you know, naturally defer to and go to a service provider but you must also acknowledge that organizations out there instantly think of government that couldn't use a cloud-based provider and so they would have some form of internal skill set or internal skill pool to call from to run, build and operate these services.